Okay, back in the shop. Today we're going to start to put together the base units for the remodelling of the workshop. I've done a detailed drawing in SketchUp. I've also done a cutting plan so I can maximise the use of the boards. I've got a cut list and the other day with the help of my father we were out here and we cut all of the boards into panels. So we've got here the braces, we've got the shelves and the doors and here we've got the bottom panels and these are the side panels. I've just now got to cut a recess in the side panels to accept the braces which I'm going to do now. Just marked out the cutouts for the two braces in the side panels. So we've got a short cutout, 100mm long at the front of the panel and another cutout, 125mm long at the back of the panel to accept both braces. I'm just going to cut them out with a jigsaw. Okay, I've cut the two notches for the braces. I've deliberately made the back brace 125mm, 5 inches long, which is deeper than the front brace because this is going to prevent the cabinet from racking so it just needs to be a little bit stiffer. The one at the front ties the cabinet together but it doesn't give as much structural stability as the rear brace. All the notches are cut in the side panels. I made sure when I was cutting them to do a left and right handed panel. I had a little bit of tear out when we were ripping the panels initially so I want to keep that on the inside keep the good side to the outside so now I've got them in matching pairs left and right for the three cabinets okay so I'm laying out the door hinges on the door panels and by far the easiest way to do this is to get one of these templates which gives you the center position for the hole for the recess it also gives you the drill positions for the screws measure from the end of the panel to the center 85 millimeters and mark a line and then place the template over the edge of the door making sure that the cutout is on your center mark punch the hole for the middle of the rebate and also punch the holes for the screws then over to the drill press with a false a bit cut out the hole and then they fit perfectly every time to make sure the hinges are lined up on the side panels a little tip what I do is I place a door panel on top of one of the side panels I give myself a 2mm gap at the top of the door to make sure that the door will swing open freely and then I transfer my hinge positions from the door to the side panel And then that way I know that the positions are going to be exactly right when I come to mark the screw holes in the side panel. The template that comes with the hinges is conveniently marked on both sides. This side shows the setting out for the holes for the recess part of the hinge in the door. And this side of the template is marked for the opposing part of the hinge that goes on the side panel and it shows the location of the screws. So now I've transferred my marks from my door to my side panel. It's simply a case of placing the template where my mark is and then punching through for the screw positions. These particular hinges come with four screw locations. So I've simply lined the hinge up with the original set of holes and then punch through for the second pair of holes. If you don't have one of these templates to come with your hinges, you can make your own. Here's how I do it. I take a scrap of plywood, I drill a hole in it with a force and a bit exactly the same as I've done on the doors. I screw a hinge to it. I close the hinge and then get a scrap of hardboard I put the hardboard against the back of the hinge simulating the side panel. I can then with a pencil mark through the screw positions onto the hardboard and then pre-drill some holes so I can use this as a template. Once I've got the holes drilled I mark a centre line between the holes 
and cut a small V up to the centre line just so I can see my mark on the side panel and then place this new template on the side panel making sure that it's flush with the edge and then simply with a bradle punch through the holes to mark the locations for the hinges.